Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Exclusive Likes, and welcome to my Horizon Zero Dawn Let's Play. This is episode 8, of course, in glorious 4K. And now that the corrupted zones are cleared out, let's see if they finally open the gate. And let's see where the story gets the news. Okay, we're out here. Uh, the corrupted zone itself has already been cleared out. We're going to be talking to the commander of the Karja border fort. A seeker at the gates. Pretty much transitioning over to the next spot. Let's see how it goes. I'm trying my best to definitely have uh, a save just for myself to do all the side quests and, and full on completion and stuff. And, and then one for just this let's play itself, which is pretty, pretty great. I'm actually enjoying playing this game this way with you guys and being able to show you guys the game is cool. Okay, this game looks fantastic when it's in like sunlight, when it's like full brightness like this. It looks so good. So. Will you open the gate for me now? <laughs> you heard her! Open the gates! And send word to Captain Balon. Where are you headed, girl? West! To Meridian! The way of broken stones is a hard run, even in the best of times. You might want to have a word with Captain Balon. He came from Meridian not long ago. You find him in the fort, on a balcony to the left overlooking the valley. Okay, thanks. We're the ones who should be thanking you for taking down those machines. Walk in light, Nora. All right, there's there's a safe spot up here. Campfire, yes, there is. Very nice. Oh, let me do a quick save. Ah. Huh. Okay, uh, I guess we have to do something else before we're able to pick out the quick save. We have to go all the way to talk to, oh, that's to go to talk to Meridian, but they said that we should talk to Captain Balo first, which apparently is a side quest, going to the... That's what I say. Trophy earned, fought back to corruption. Alright, let's talk to the captain. Looks like this side quest I would have to show you guys. Captain Balon? The guard at the gate said you'd been to Meridian recently. What can I expect on the trail? Nothing good. More machines all the time. And our scouts report corruption that way as well. So much for sealing things off. Keep to the roads. They're safe enough. Though after what you did at the gate, I'll wager you don't scare easy. It's a good quality. I could put it to use, if you don't mind a quick jaunt back east. I know it's bold of me to ask a favor after you just did one, but... I can offer you answers in return. If there's anything you need to know about the Sundom. What do you need, Captain? I sent several patrols east when we got word of corrupted machines there. I'll let them confirm my fears, so I sealed the gates. But it looks like we left some men behind when they were closed. Walid, tell her what happened. Machines attacked us near an abandoned Nora village, sir. Lakir told us to pull back. Then I lost sight of the others. Never seen a Nora woman before, soldier? Have some respect. Report to her, not to me. Lakir always stresses reporting back, so that's what I did. I felt terrible about leaving them behind. Well, now that the gates are open again, I can send someone after them. Can't you send more soldiers to find the missing men? What about Walid here? Most Nora still don't take well to the side of Karja armor. Officially, it's a risk to send patrols so close to your sacred land. I'd prefer not to do that again. But heading that way won't be a problem for you. Please say yes. What was that, soldier? Nothing, sir. What is this place exactly? Day Tower marks the eastern edge of Karja territory. A trading post, a way station. One with an ugly reputation among your people. During the reign of the last Sun King, many Nora were taken captive, then gathered here for transport to Meridian and sacrifice. But the sun set on that. I was appointed by the Sun King of Vod to make sure old Karja at this outpost show respect to the Nora. Where do things stand between your tribe and the Nora now? Sun King of Vod wants peace. So do the matriarchs, I'm told. But old wounds are slow to mend, and both tribes are proud. My task is to make sure there are no further provocations from the Sundo. Especially now, after... Well... While your people recover from this terrible attack, I mean...
What's Meridian like? Well, it's a changed place. A living city. Nothing like it was during the rule of Sun King Juran. Havad, our new king, has done all he can to make sure of that. Slavery has been abolished. There's a new alliance with the Azaram. And the Sunring, where so many outlanders were killed, is now a memorial to the Fallen. So the Karja are allied with the Azaram? Hard to believe, but it's true. Mad Sun King Juran raided the Azaram for years. Avad managed to get them on his side. He had help, of course. Ursa and Eren played a part. Azaram's siblings, bigger than life. They gathered an army to free Meridian. I marched with them. Scaled the North Cliff with my men and secured the Temple of the Sun. Sent Juran's kestrels and priests packing. Now Azaram are a common sight in the city. And a common sound, too. They sure bicker a lot. It sounds as though you approve of the new Sun King. He is the Chosen of the Sun. And what the Sundom needs after ten years of war. A calming light, not a scouring one. Sun King Juran would shed blood at any slight. For Sun King Avad, that's a last resort. Lucky for those who slight him. Some whisper in the shadows that he's weak. No. Peace is strength, as the sun shall show. Is there anything more you can tell me about the road to Meridian? Sun King Avad has devoted considerable resources to making it safe. But by the sun's witness, it's been harder to control in peace than it was during the war. The machines grow more dangerous all the time. Add to that bandits and new reports of this corruption. We're stretched thin to protect a few outposts like this one. That's for everywhere else. Well, travel at your own risk. Did an Osram named Olin come through here? Twice. He was part of the royal delegation to the Nora. When they passed through on the way, then back. And they brought back stories of a vicious attack on your people. My condolences, of course. Do you know where Olin is now? Not exactly. But he was on his way to Meridian, I'm certain of that. Everyone goes to Meridian. I'll see what I can do about your missing men. I would be grateful, but not as grateful as Walid. You hear that, Lunkhead? You might be off the hook. Freaking Walid when he was like, please say yes. <laughs> He's like, come on, take it, help. Okay, so let's see if we can get back to that quick save and see if it'll work now. It should work now, hopefully. Uh, if not, I am not sure. We do have another quick save. Oh, there it is. Okay, so I made a new save uh, just in case I can go back after I continue the main game. Um, I am not sure if we really want to see what happens as far as like for this side quest. What was I looking for here? Okay, I was Be out there Whoa. Nice. Um, hmm. I kind of want to see, of course, what happens if I go uh, do the side quest. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it playing. I'm gonna keep it recording on my end. Uh, but if you see me all of a sudden skips the main quest, then you know it wasn't that interesting, right? <laughs> That's the simple answer. So let me get some gear, and then we'll be on our way. All right. <clears throat> so. After checking out what's going on, I do see that for the sake of the story, for the last time, I'm going to continue doing the main story. Like I said, I haven't saved just for the story. And then I'll be doing a side quest on my own. If you guys do want to see the side quest or anything like that, let me know um, and I can put that up for Let's Plays on. Like maybe like side stuff, you know, like on its own. <laughs> but I also don't want to make this. Uh, so many let's play episodes and like a lot of them just be filler episodes i'm gonna try to keep the filler episodes to a minimum so you'll see everything in between uh this is a long long road so i'm gonna see if i can take over strider and then run all the way to the main side because you guys don't want to see all this do you <laughs> we'll see <clears throat> let's go to meridian All right, there's an easier way to get there. Very nice. Any safe spots that I see, of course, like those, I'm gonna be trying to get for quick travel stuff. Oh, 
I, I went the wrong way, but just look at those beasts, man. They're so, they, they just look so badass. And let's go on the road. Whoa, that was not good. That actually hurt. Oh, that's not good. We're gonna have to make sure we pick up some more plants for health. That trembler. Obviously tells us what resources he gets. Do we wanna fight it? No, not, not right now. We wanna we wanna keep going and get there as fast as we can. I don't think we can technically like take that over and have it for ourselves, so we shall see. It seems to be like this is gonna be another running episode. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I I knew this game was gonna be long. I honestly had no idea it was gonna be this long. <laughs> so I'll bother. next time I I will pick a more linear story for for the sake of time <laughs> and not uh, having you guys just watch this over and over. But if I didn't get all the save points again, I missed out on a lot of quick travel stuff. So. We want to get all these things. Is there any way to slide down from here? No. Okay. I was looking for a rope, something you know, kind of traverse my way there, and then see what's happening. But apparently that doesn't happen here. So yeah, a lot of me, like a lot of this is gonna be me not really exploring the world as much as I want to. But Jesus, look at how great this looks. The last game that I saw that I think this is fantastic that I just wanted to kind of sit there and immerse in the world was Tomb Raider or Rise of the Tomb Raider. Uh, right, this is the second one. It was just fantastic. Like the first level in the snow was amazing. So seeing the desert just looked as beautiful like this. Oh, <clears throat> it just makes me want to sit and stare. But we don't have time for that. We must continue. I wonder if like I do have like maybe I'm also like doing this wrong I could have maybe picked something up and got there I don't know but it looks like we're also gonna be reaching some treacherous planes here it looks like there's like a warning sign um, something's on fire over there hmm what's over here what is over here looks ominous Looks like maybe I shouldn't. It's a bandit camp. Ooh. Huh. Do it. Handy. Why not? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Look at the tall neck over there too. <clears throat> Someone here? Uh, I don't want to stop them dying off. It's like I'm trying to keep birds. <laughs> I can't believe they're gonna attack me. Am I might be able to pick them up one by one. Whoa. Looks like I am almost. Not anymore! <laughs> Dude, get away from me. Whoa. Very nice. I couldn't see. Headshot, buddy. Oh, there's a lot more. <laughs> that is a lot more after all. Woo What? How did I miss that? Okay, good, good, good. That's fine. That's fine. That's a that's a couple of them. We could we could take them on though. We could take them on. Let's do this. Let's do this. Do it. Hold on, resources are resources, folks. Nothing else here, right? Oh, there's one over there. <clears throat> the music is really good too. Alright, let us see what we can get. 
far you would move. Somebody needs a kill. Headshots are definitely the way to go, obviously. But I also need to be better. That's the leader there. Oh, I thought there was like something next to me lucky there was not. I can go around though. Let's do this, do it, let's do it, let's see what we can go up here. No, not again. What? Why do I keep doing that? Okay, so it looks like I can't really go around, so go back. I'm not gonna do that again, though. Hurt myself. <clears throat> He's also the boss, so it's even better. Very nice. Dude, look at that. That that was a boss kill. Done and done. We gotta clear him out. Look at that. What's up? No time to do this nicely. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Who else is next? Who else is next? I have fire. <laughs> that signal will bring in reinforcements if they set it off. Make like a watcher and find him. Make like a watcher. <laughs> Completed bending cap. Ooh, look at that. 10,000 XP. Very nice. Are all my resources still there or are they all gone? Oh, let's see. First bending came clear. Looks like all my resources are gone except for the fire splitter. Very, very unfortunate, but it's okay. Ah, whoa, actually some of them are here, don't mind. Good. And now, she's gonna tell me, sorry. We're here. But it seems to be on lockdown. I wonder why. Halt. Stop right there. In light of the recent attack, no stranger passes into Meridian without submitting to search. Recent attack? What are you talking about? The murder of Captain Ursa and her vanguards, of course. Ambushed by Shadow Carja forces in Redridge Pass. Ursa? You mean Erend's sister is dead? How would you know his name? I know Erend. Summon him. I need to speak to him. Ha! Huh. I doubt that Erend, the new captain of the Vanguard, a man in grief, is going to waste his time on a grimy outlander. Aloy! Hey, you're alive! I thought you were... 
dead. Make way, make way. All the way to Meridian just to see me? Have you been drinking? Ah, not really. A little. So you're alive. This, uh, we should celebrate. The drink's on me. We need to talk alone, and you need to pull together. Over there. So you approve? Of course I approve. From now on, she may come and go from this city as she pleases. As you wish, sir. There. Alone as you asked. And what did you want to tell me? A lot has happened since we last spoke. The proving was attacked by a group of killers. Not many of us survived. We were in the village when we heard explosions up on the mountain. And some of your braves came back, said most of the contestants were dead. I've never heard such a wail of grief as the sound that rose up from your people. How did you survive? How I survived is less important than how I was targeted. Targeted? What do you mean? The killers came for me because of Owen. What are you talking about? That doesn't make sense. I need to find Owen. I need to know what he knows. But he's a friend. No, he's a traitor. I don't know who the killers are or what they want, but I do know that Owen is working with them. But, I mean, this... I don't need you to understand, Erend. I just need you to take me to him. He's not here. He went scrounging for scrap and relics days ago. It could be anywhere. Are there any places he frequents, places he returns to? A house, here in Meridian. Okay, then take me there. I need to search it. I guess, as long as I'm there to witness the search. I heard what happened to Ursa. I'm sorry. I know she was special to you. Special to me? <laughs> special to everyone. She always knew what to do. She bossed everyone around. She kept me in line. Now I'm supposed to fill her shoes. And instead, here I am, stumbling around in them. I, uh... I lost someone, too. At the Proving, the man who raised me. His name was Rost. That's terrible. But why is it every time something terrible happens? Everyone else tells you the worst thing that ever happened to them, as though that makes it easier. Yeah, why is that? Anyway, th there was something you wanted to tell me? I need to see Olin's place. Now. Okay, okay. Uh, come on. Let's get to Olin's place. So many people here all talking at once. How does anyone think? I don't. I just drink. This guy, I mean, I understand though, you know, his sister's dead. That must be the spire. Is she? Crazy. It's huge. Apparently <coughs> letting anyone Everybody coats with loss differently, you know? These are good and necessity. Vengeance for Ursa. You'll like what I have to say. Year after year, why does he spare those who enslaved and tortured and butchered? Errant, you should want vengeance more than anyone. Your own sister, murdered, and her death, unavenged? One more word, you scorched out slag, and I'll throw you in jail myself. Now get out of here, or I'll give you all a kick in the ass. What did he mean about Ursa's murder? Ooh. Not now. Not the time at all, dude. Not the time at all. Hard. Because also, is this Olin's place? This okay, how are we gonna get in? <laughs> oh, that was subtle. Here we are, trying not to break anything, yeah. other than the door. <laughs> That's already been broken. 
seriously. Days to have connections in the king's court. Wow, what a place. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for this episode of Horizon Zero Dawn. I know it's kind of a fuller episode again, uh, getting to here, but we're getting ever and ever closer to more of the story. We finally got to Olin's place. Obviously, we saw what happened to your sister. I'm gonna go and do some side quests right now and uh, level up this character as well, so I might be a little bit stronger by the time you come back. But as always, guys, if you guys like this video, hit that like button. If you want to watch videos like this, hit that subscribe button if you're on YouTube. If you're on Twitch watching this video premiere, don't forget to put those popcorn emotes in the chat. Thank you guys so much for joining me live as we watch the video together. Uh, and if you haven't done so, don't forget the link down below. And again, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 8 a.m. Pacific time, 4K videos on YouTube at 8 p.m. Pacific time. Video premieres at 1080p on Twitch. Come and join us live when we talk in the chat. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. I'm Check exclusive. Relax. Welcome maybe. to the exclusive family. We're in for a hell of a ride. Take care, you guys.